Hi, I'm Kelly Moran and I'm the project manager for the Ballarat is Open project here at the City of Ballarat. This project has been all about discovering the identity of Ballarat, how we see ourselves as a city now and what we want for our future. When we developed the Creative City strategy last year, our community told us that they really value creative design thinking and they wanted to use more of that in how we go about collaborating on projects in Ballarat in the future. So that's what we've been doing. We've been talking to our community and using workshops, using creative design thinking to gather ideas, thoughts and feelings about the future of this city and what we stand for. Through our design thinking workshops and other consultation, we've uncovered what it is that Ballarat truly cares about and how that impacts the future we're creating for our city. I think just a, a vibrant, healthy, livable city, somewhere that people are proud to live, and also something, a, a city that's got a reputation that attracts visitors and businesses that want to come here and see this as part of their future. I think in Ballarat's future there's going to be a lot more support for like uh, young people doing arts and culture and hopefully more support for small businesses trying to start up. Yeah, my vision for Ballarat is it's an incredibly caring community and one that's driven by 100% renewable energy. I would like to see us as a world's best example of how we nurture and look after our victims of institutional child abuse. How we would get there, I think, would transform us all. I guess my vision is through innovation and collaboration that Ballarat become indispensable really in the state and probably the country for perhaps one to two key aspects, whether that be waste management or something else, um, that drives, of course, um, funding back into our city to provide other services for the community. We've then used that to inspire the creation of ideas for projects, events and policies that could help bring these things to life. This gives us an idea of the kinds of things you want covered in and made possible by the Ballarat Prosperity Framework, which will be the outcome of this project. We'll now go away and draft the framework based on what we've learned through our consultation. This will go to our reference group who have been engaged with the project from the beginning for their feedback and then to council for sign off in early 2020 before it's circulated to the entire community for us all to put into practice.